All right. So as we go to Vault 3, we should be able to take out quite a few of these damn fiends. Whoa. Hi. That was... Some bad shooting on my part, but we made up for it. Let's go for it. I think I could crawl up this beam right here. Oh. I thought I'd hit that. Okay, come through the... All right. Okay. Not what I was expecting, but sure. I hit the baseball bat. He's over here. We got him. Man, I'm gonna pick up a lot of uh, five, five, six pistols, aren't I? Probably won't be compatible with my art with my player outfit. I will take the grenades though. Yeah. Wait, have I killed Cook Cook? Yeah, yeah, because there's nothing on the shelves here. Okay, these are just respawned. Okay, cool. All right, let's grab some fiend brahmin meat, I guess. I have done the fiend so many times in my life, I sometimes don't know if I've killed them enough. Or if I've killed them in the file I'm playing. You can never kill enough feeds. It's like a Fallout 4. I love killing raiders. Oh, wow. You don't have legs anymore. some of those. What's up? And 
And that was Fat Crab. Now my ammo weighs half as much as it does, as it did. Ah, that was a Bottle cap. Everybody passing the shotgun around, I guess. Don't know why I have this. a lot of meat over there. <coughs> hmm. Yeah, we stick with this. Oh. Let's disarm that then. That didn't cause them to move forward? The fuck you doing, dude? Fight! Well, I guess we're doing it this way! Just a case. All right. That's somebody's eyeball. Flashbang, wow. Nicola Quartz. Well, it was a pretty big explosion. There's an SMG somewhere in here. Guaranteed place to get a bumper sword. They're not that common, so I like to pick up a few. I'm gonna jab myself. Ooh, Nuka Cola. That's always a good one. Whoa. 
nice clip. Damn it, that's gonna stink. Oh, you fucked up. As soon as you turn around the corner and there's just 70% chance for a headshot. Oh, it's gonna be a bloodbath. I haven't even stepped foot inside that vault yet. I know there's one. Oh, there's the other body. And I know there's another one, at least. Damn, I'm running out of ammo. Pumper sword. <laughs> Repair that with a 556 five, pistol. That's only a single shot, but the other shot's a trip one. Huh. What the fuck are you doing here? You got some kind of fucking death wish, asshole? Isn't this Vault 3 home of the fiends? Final warning, asshole. Get the fuck out of here or we are gonna waste your ass. Taking a sip. Let's see how tough you are. All right, asshole. You just fucked yourself. Contact. One of those is the compliance regulator. Bunga it is. Fire. 
Yep, that was the compliance regulator. All right, cool. Hey, Boone, I think we're gunfire again. So much nicer because the uh, fiends couldn't get in here. Nudes, nudes. A face-to-face -face meeting with House, huh? NCR would kill to be in your shoes. Give me to talk to you, but sure. Have you heard of Mr. House? Yeah. I don't know much, just rumors. All I know is he's supposed to be in charge of the Strip. He's been able to stop the NCR from taking it over. Wish he'd give it up so the NCR could focus on securing the border. Alright. Keep looking. Yeah, they're around. I love killing fiends with the light shining in darkness because it just, it, it fits. Oh, there you are. Let's rock. Shit. Okay, there's a couple guys in there. Yeet! Uh-oh. Well, this is weird. I will take some of that stim pack. All right, get some of that sunset sarsaparilla. I love root beer, so I'd, I'd be a huge fiend since I'd set Sasperl in the Fallout universe. Damn, you guys did a lot of drugs, didn't you? You know what? Might as well repair a little bit of that. I don't know why I'm collecting ponchos, it just feels right.
This used to be my phone's background for a little while. There we go. I think this has a f bunch of free medical supplies in here. Toolbox, sensor module, okay. You suck! I'm gonna just force the lock, 85% chance, I'll take it. And let's just fill. That person full of bullets. Eat this. side of yours. Oh, it looks like we're about to save some hostages. And do you know what? Let's repair that. I think there's actually a challenge to killing with the 44 Magnum, so... Okay. We 
got the key. We got the compliance regulator. We are doing fine. And I didn't mean to hit the button. I just have to check something on my phone. There we go. Why did you shoot? Alright. I do not have the rebreather yet. I think I just pulled fiction that guy. Shot all around him. All right. First we go this way. Because those guys are going to go this way and they'll trip everything. How the hell did you get in here? And who the hell are you? Can you tell me about this place? What are you looking to find out? Tell me, NCR is Ranger. tell me what an NCR Ranger is doing here. Tell me why I should tell you anything. I don't know you. Yeah, good point. I'm an independent contractor with the NCR. Oh, my apologies, sir. I was sent here by Colonel Shu to exterminate Motor Runner, the leader of the Fiends. What can you tell me about what happened here? The Fiends killed everyone living here. Now they're squatting in their home. Who are the Fiends? The fiends are degenerate drug addicts who kill and rape for fun, basically. Yeah, of course. Human garbage. Though I'm not sure about the human part. Hey! Colonel who, uh, Colonel Sue sent, or he, yeah. He sent me to find you. He sent you? Why? You missed your check-in. Colonel Sue says theme is your support. Is that right? And what sort of support exactly is it that you have to offer? I want to help you rescue the hostages. Yeah, nice thought, but that's not my... Let me take out Motor Runner. Bad idea. You know myself just fine. Found you, didn't I? I guess you have a point. And I don't know how long it'll be before I'm on both feet. Here, take this. It's the key to the maintenance wing. Should make getting a motor runner that much easier. Good luck. And he fucking skedaddles. Oh, God damn it. That's on you. Eat that squirrel stew. Take down this password. It'll get you into the overseer's area upstairs, I think. Thanks for the help. We'll find our own way out. Hey! Thanks for the help. Thank you for releasing us. 
You're welcome. In this place, it should be pristine. Which it is. Overseer's terminal. Unlock storage room doors. Oh, that's where the weapon lockers are. See, now I'm tempted to just fucking go for it. Yeah, bud, just fucking go for it, eh? Just fucking gun it. Yeah, I'm gonna be losing health. Almost. Both out. Oh! Right there. Oh well. Oh, yeah, you did. Okay, let's go kill the rest of the people in here. What do we have for ammo here? Eight shotgun slug shells. You know what? I could use this. Continue. I accidentally shot Boone. Open the door. Fuck. There we go.
slug right to the back of the head. Donnie and Marie. That's a reference. Forget who I give this to. I think Colonel Hugh. Reverse pulse cleaner. We'll need that in several hours. Sometimes I like seeing head pop. I don't know. Just as a reminder, make sure you're on Wi-Fi, not data. I am on Wi-Fi and I'm not on data. Alright, clean those guys out. Let's go to the gun runners and sell some shit. Welcome, sir. Alright, 8K. Let's go over our stuff. Really quickly. Get that nine iron, boxing tape. <laughs> Service rifle. That should be good. Welcome, sir. Magnum revolver. There we go. Let's get all this out of here. There we go. Grab some four to five. Twelve gauge. Five. Do you want to, let's get some dragon's breath. I appreciate you guys want to see some dragon's breath, don't you? Do you want to pick some of that up? That's not worth selling. Need to keep one of them. Frag grenades. Now we'll keep. Mines, however. Wait, I think this is a different day because this. Let's see if I can mod it. No. How about I aim my gun at you for a while, see how you like it? Sorry. Okay, I've got one mod conflicting with this, but this is fine. It needed to be nerfed to 12 rounds anyways. Yeah. 
use this for a bit. And after killing those guys, ripping through all those fiends. You with? Yeah, you're with. Oh man, are there other legion positions that I could assault? Can help out. Yeah, that's the thing. I gotta help out the NCR bases too. I want them to idolize me, so when I take Vegas for themselves, they're like, "What? What do you mean?" Yeah, we're just gonna grab a bunch of 12 gauge. Yeah, there we go. And to this, I'm going to be adding that one. And I'm picking up that. And I'm putting in the hunting shotgun. And adds a couple weapons. Give this the compliance regulator. Flashbang goes there. Oh, and the service rifle. Well, that's used to heal up a light and shine. Uh, the survivalist rifle, I mean. Light and shining armor. Nope. Light shining in the darkness. I would like to get the forge receiver and the upgrade springs. I also would like to use that as a main rifle, but oh well. Dragon's breath. No. There we go. Right back to where I was. All right, let's get rid of this, which I believe. There we go, Cam McCarran. Even after all these years, the Inner Vegas map just trips me up sometimes. I 
As you can see, they've been shot at a few times. Karen. Son, Anders showed up here not too long ago. I'm told you're the one who got him out of the vault. Can't tell you how relieved I am. Sending him on that mission was a mistake. He did the right thing. If he sent more, they have been killed. Or he didn't have a choice. The Fiends were a growing threat. That's probably true. But I wonder if I should have taken a different strategy entirely. Although my options were certainly limited, with most of our forces tied up garrisoning this place. Regardless, what you did for Anders isn't something he or any of us around here take lightly. We're all glad to have him back. Thank you. Moonrunner's dead. I brought his helmet as proof. Unbelievable. That man has given us so much grief since we set up here. This may be a major turning point for us. Took me years to figure out to give him his fucking helmet. Taking him out, only to have him show up again later, taking more heads off of fallen troopers. This is for the bounty. And this is from a pool me and a lot of the soldiers around the base had going. You may not be in CR, but hey, it's only fair. Nice. I'm up for hire if you need some extra manpower on the base. There are a lot of things I can't spare troops for right now. If you can help us, we can definitely pay you for your work. Hmm. You don't cook by any chance, do you? Farber's doing his best, but it's hard to manage an army with half my staff in line for the latrine. Honestly, we're fighting a lot of fires right now. The fiends keep pressing their position from Vault 3. We've got the Legion breathing down our necks across the river. We actually took an officer al Any other problems? Yeah. On top of everything else, I can't send a patrol on a bathroom break without it being ambushed by someone who heard they were coming. So somebody's getting the word out. Find the mole. I can look into his leaking and see our intelligence. Hmm. Well, why not? Given your recent arrival, at least I can safely rule you out as the leak. I'd like to have absolute trust in my men, but that's just not practical right now. Go ahead and look into it. See what you find. We don't have much to go on right now. Lately, every raiding party in New Vegas seems to have a map of our troop movements. It derails everything. Supplies, reinforcements, and it'll only get worse the longer we let it go on. Captain Curtis is heading up the investigation right now. He can fill you in. You seem calm given everything that uh, things are as bad as they are. Calm is what you have to be when people look to you. And it's all you can be when things are out of your hands. I bet I can make that Legion prisoner talk. I have Lieutenant Boyd on that already, and she's excellent. But I think she's hit a wall. Talk to her if you like. See if she has any use for you. Her office is right above mine, but I think she might be interrogating right now. So she'd be upstairs on the other side of the building. All right. On top of that... You're new. I'm Angela. Williams. Were you just looking around, or...? Need help with anything? You mean, give you work? No, that'd be up to the administrator, Hildern. He's back there in his office. Between you and me, I don't think he ever leaves. Plenty of mercs go in to see him, though. Mercenaries? What for? I can't say. We're not supposed to talk about the research. Not the details. If you're interested, I'm sure he'd see you. What's his place? This? The OSI lab. We don't get many visitors. The smell puts people off, I think. Nobody ever said science would smell clean and fresh. Anyway, you get used to it if you give it some time. <laughs> Are you a scientist? I know, I don't sound the part. Get raised by Brahmin ranchers and you never lose the twang. Drives Hildern crazy. But I know every inch of the power grid from Hoover Dam to Shady Sands. That's what we do here. Try to optimize the power output from the dam. 
Some of the others are working on an agricultural project, but truth be told, they aren't making much progress. Not yet, anyway. What's your role? Head researcher. Mostly on the dam project, but I help out on other things when they need me. Gotta be flexible. All right, goodbye. Nice to meet you. If you need anything, I'm almost always in the lab. Hey. A pleasure to meet you. I'm Dr. Thomas Hildern, Director of Operations, OSI East. I presume you're here about Vault 22? Yes, that's right. Wonderful. Straight to it, then. Have you signed the release forms? No? Doesn't matter. We'll keep that to ourselves. Vault 22. Where to begin? I'm listening. Imagine, if you will, the wasteland in bloom. Vast fields of corn that grow from seeds and produce their bounty in the space of a month. Orchards of trees, their branches weighed halfway to the ground, hung with fat. And all of this, all this. Nothing is important. Get to the point. Fair enough. My point is this. I believe that the inhabitants of Vault 22 unlock the secrets of vegetative growth. Plants are spilling from their gate. No one tends them. No one waters them. Yet they multiply and spread in all directions. Find the reason for this miraculous growth, and I promise you the OSI will see that you are generously compensated. All right, I'll do it. Good. No need to check in with the NCR authorities. I can authorize your payment from OSI accounts. Oh, that seems Most very clean. They a server room on a lower level where they would have backed up their research data. A computer room, you understand? Download all the information on the central server to your pip boy. And you'll be certain to bring me any notes or samples that you find, won't you? Anything else I should know? I thought it was a fairly straightforward assignment. It's a simple question of retrieving the data, which shouldn't prove overly challenging. Downloading the data will be handled by your pit boy. You might think of yourself as a... All right, peace. Did Dr. Hildern... This really isn't any of my business, but did he give you a job? You're right, it's none of your... Yeah, he asked me to get some data to 22. I shouldn't say anything. I know that. But you're not the first person Hildern sent out to the vault. There were a lot of mercs. One after another. None of them came back. Then, about a week ago, there was a scientist, Keeley. She's unusual. Not the sort of person you'd expect. But she's an absolute genius. And... And he didn't mention her? Not even her name? Or any of the other mercs? No, Hilton didn't mention anyone else. But now he's hired you, which means one of two things. Either he heard back from Keeley and she failed, or he's given up on her. Listen, I make a fair wage, but I'm not rich, not by any means. Maybe my kind of money wouldn't appeal to your average merc, but I'm willing to pay you if you'll find Keeley and make sure she's safe. In right leaving her out there. No idea if she's alive or dead. Uh, I'll try, but no promises. That's all I ask. She might even be able to help you. As long as you don't speak too well of Dr. Hildern. Goodbye. Right. Good luck. I feel like doing their stance in the grass. Give me two seconds. Making sure I got that. Okay. I, what do I want? I want to go and, yeah, let's just go. Go to the vault.
Well, oh, that's some good loading. Oh, the whole... Hey, that might be a modded area. Let's go check it out. Need to do this. Sometimes you have to be like, all right, let's get out of here. This isn't quest related. We're gonna get distracted. We're going over here. We just have to be careful, cause man. There's some nasty Casadors around here. Then again, I have got the auto shotty. Make sure I get the big ones, because those are the ones that suck. Ooh, got the wing. Alright, do you know what? We reduced their numbers. I feel happy with what we've done. Let's go murder some plants. I get 20 AP every time I kill somebody. I just realized that the uh, undergrowth might stop our vats there. Anything up here? the elevator but we go down by foot or you know what I mean floor by floor
Basically, Keely came into here. This is Vault 22, the place where uh, the cannibals were in Zion Valley. And what happened was they were researching spores and different things for picking up uh, and, and, you know, plant growth and such. And pretty much they developed spores that started taking over the body and pretty much, you know, the last of us. Except instead of mushrooms, you turn into green people. The spores would grow in their lungs and then would take over their entire body. Keely doesn't want us to give her research away. Sample of that stuff is somewhere. Here. Green boys be hiding in the green. Like food additive. Hey, they do carry sport carrier sack. Hmm. I gotta go to the overseer. There's some bugs behind that wall. They just heard my shot, that's all. Heard them give that a quick pop. creepy crawly guys in the ground here. That's why I'm sneaking. That's why I'm sneaking. It's because they activate later and uh, well, I just critical. Good Indica. Got my favorite strain, Rockstar. I feel like there would be a guy in here. of overrides. I want to set something on fire. Is 
Stay sharp. Hi. I'm really enjoying these rounds. But I guess when you use them, it gets, you know. Oh, come on, one more XP, please. When you're hitting plant things with fire, I guess it will feel a little bit more powerful. Nah, keep looking. We're doing fine. I stunned it mid animation. The man turned into mush. Anyways, we want right there. Was it gonna be like spy check? <laughs> All right, so this is recreation. Fifth to pest control. Laser rifle is in here. That one's dead.
Shoots a green laser instead of a red one. Toasty toasty. All right, 800 more things and then I've killed pretty much everything. <laughs> now, I, Apocalypse 8 got nothing on me is the additional perk you get. Looks Lord Death, plus 5% damage. Two. Oh shit, I need to heal. That took a chunk out. What does this do? Gun condition, oh, it's just, it wears your gun down more, okay. CR sent you? Yes, Angela Williams asked me to come find you. Oh, she's such a dear. Not like that pompous little Peden she works for. But that's neither here nor there. These plants have gotten completely out of control. I've got a plan to deal with them, but I'll need your help. Of course, I'd be glad to help. Good. Meet me on the second level, and I'll explain what needs to be done. Most people don't know that that's a thing. And yeah, 12 XP. 5, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, yeah. If you pop uh, the Boothicker Wire, whatever the hell that shit's called, 
Uh, you just crush all of those. And you get credit for one-handed pistol kills. post-it note with all the sticky saying what increased wavelengths and whatever to make it a green deadlier laser. Repairs. Not bad. Save. Second floor, I think. Yeah. Good, you're here. Ready to begin. Yeah, I can help. Time is of the essence, so I'll be brief. This place is filled with spores that are toxic to humans, and we need to get rid of them. I pumped the vault full of a highly flammable gas that, once ignited, should destroy the vast majority of spores. There's one problem, though. The gas becomes semi-inert on exposure to oxygen, meaning the gas will have to be ignited close to where it's being introduced. I need you to find the vents where the gas is being pumped and ignite it. Oh, and survive the resulting blast. Uh, how exactly should I ignite the gas? In the area where the gas is active, any kind of fire or explosion should do the trick. Hell, even lasers would do the job. If you don't have anything like that, I've got some grenades in my bag in the corner that you can use. Any idea where those vents are I'm looking for? I set the gas to pump into the fifth level since that's where the concentration of... Typically, these vaults use circular vents in their air circulation systems. Look for a wall with two of them almost side by side. There's one just around the corner outside this lab if you need an example. Blast? Yes. There'll be an explosion when the gas is ignited. But I'm sure you'll be fine. Now leave me to my work. Good. All right. So let's try not blowing ourselves up. So yeah, we gotta ignite that. Drag out. Here we go. If you're in the hallway, you get incinerated and you do not live. It's not like the other times where you get floofed and it's like, ah, oh, whatever. No, that one you actually get ripped apart. Ah, good. You survived. I was beginning to think you hadn't. You'll be pleased to know that the spore should no longer be a problem. Now all that's left is to ensure that none of this ever happens again. The research that led to these abominations must be erased. What needs to be done? I've managed to create a connection to the vault's backup system from here. I just have to remotely delete all the files, and we're done here. Will it take long? No, it shouldn't take all that long. Just a few more moments, and that's strange. The system says that the files were accessed recently and copied to an external source. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? No, I've been too busy rescuing you. Could someone else have done it? It's possible. I've spent the last few days in a cave, after all. For all we know, that man sent someone immediately after you to swipe the data while you posed as mantis bait. Nothing to be done about it, I suppose. All we can do is delete what's here, and that's done. I've unlocked the door, so you can <laughs> long now. Although it pains me to say it, I wouldn't have made it out of here without your help. If you're heading back toward McCarran, 
tell Dr. Williams that she has my thanks as well. See? Lose karma, gain karma. It evens out in the end. I want to go to fifth level. In this way. And in here. Actually, I need to go in there. I'll need those for six hours from now. <laughs> Solid 100. Good, now I got those. You get sent to these vaults to get those things, so it just saves a lot of time. So I'm going to purposely put my fists up. This will count as one-handed kills. Take him out. I'm just going to crush him all. Crush, 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 crush. All right. Squish, 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 squish. Got what we need, gotta get out of here. Get the terminal building, hand in the data. Get even liked more by the NCR. Because I'm going to go run up and give this food additive to the guy who runs the kitchen. Keely just called in. You should have heard the director. But I... Wait a... Now look here. She wouldn't let him finish a sentence. Just reamed him out for sending all those people to the vault. I've never seen his face so red and twitchy. Thanks for keeping her safe. Here's the caps I promised. I knew I had a good feeling about you. Goodbye. Thanks again. Really, I owe you. 800, nice. I received a pleasant call from Dr. Keeley. It seems we have you to thank for keeping her alive. Very charitable of you. I brought the data from Vault 22. Wonderful. Excellent work. Let me see it. It'll take a moment to decode on my terminal. No problem, I can wait. I think William's decryption algorithms seem to be working. Yes, here it is. The data is mostly uncorrupted. This will make the board of directors finally sit up and take notice. 
Here then, as promised, an agreeable sum payable upon delivery of the data. You've more than done your part. Oh, 2,000 caps. Glad to be of service. A pleasure working with you, really. I'll make certain that you're mentioned in the final report. You have my word on it. Decorate, I have items. Oh, sweet. Hell yeah. Now, I'm going to go to the 188 trading post, see what they got for mods for weapons. I get sniper rifle suppressor. That'd be nice. But honestly, I'll, I'll see what they have. I'll take what they got. What is it? Not that much, Boone. All right. What do you got to sell to me? I've still got guns and ammo if you need. Nothing too crazy. Ha! <laughs> Reinforced Mark II. Ah, oh, too bad it looks like ass. Auto rifle, internal link upgrades, battle rifle, composite stock. Nope. Take that though. I'm talking to this job's boring enough without talking to chill you. out girl people you we're just still making a nuisance of yourself I'm fucking run around so we have for sale this job boring fuck yourself service rifle stuff that's fine we got the custom we were good for that grab some of those ooh 232 pounds 80 rounds 94 rounds dragon's breath because I'm, I'm actually now liking them I just get to Thanks. keep this helmet. Cool. This muscle. Alexander's the man to talk to. It's always good for fish. All right. We need to find. I'm going to Matthew's Animal Husbandry Farm. And we're gonna do some hunting around here. There's gonna be some other areas. Cause I have a mod that distributes GRA items all around the place. And you know what? I feel like, I feel like we could have some use, you know? Okay. We 
We have been here before. I'm actually surprised that those things were- these guys were alive. Free cattle prod! Do I have any water? Yeah, I'll go. Plenty of water. Go, go, go. I have a mod also that adds in some extra creatures. Some of them happen to be robots. Trooper Ghoul. Oh, that's fine. Oh, is that the vertebrate? There's a vertebrate over there. Oh. Yeah, it's surrounded by hardened gutsies. Okay, yeah. Sneak attack crits. OP as hell. Four, five, six. I don't think I could survive an actual direct confrontation with those robots. See if that moves uh, any over there. Got it. Okay. Now we just run in. Any robots, we just fill them with lead. Oh, fuck. Tesla beaten prototype. 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 Tesla beaten prototype. 
take all the ammo. This is the unique Tesla cannon. Introduced to Fallout 3. The uh, Brotherhood uses it in Fallout, for, uh, Fallout New Vegas very rarely. I saw the crater. I'm like, oh, that thing's over there, isn't it? And hey, that's a great Tesla. I might as well pick up the bonus great weapons, right? Even if it's not necessarily the uh, kind we'll use. Fire on that boon? Oh. There was way more over there, by the way, than I thought. Oh, this is the rumor. And those are ghouls with guns. There was not supposed to be ghouls with guns there. Means I have a mod adding enemies over there. Oh, I see mist. I think I just saw some powder gangers go over the horizon. Oh, there's now a giant camp of ghoul raiders. Oh, we actually have to, if we're going to take that on, we actually have to bring heavy weaponry. An actual armor. That is now turned into a top tier high enemy area of the game. Wow. Cool what mods will do, eh? Anyways, we'll go this way. Yeah, that's definitely gonna kill us. Oh, I wonder if that's where they put Esther. That would explain, if, they, if Esther's there, that would explain the heavy military, the heavy ghoul presence there. Military ghoul presence? Oh no, I like to think that they're more organized in that little section there. I like to add my own little thoughts to some of the world sometimes. Gotta immerse yourself, right? All right, do you want, I actually kinda, kinda do want to take it on. But I don't have the weaponry for it. Could get the unique minigun over in the devil's throat. No, 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 we'll, we'll keep going in for the main. I do think that with us fighting higher level creatures and such, we gotta get in to the Desert Ranger armor. And we can put the, des uh, the Tesla Beta prototype up there on the wall. Ha, there's the unique. Oh, it's down there, nice. All right, let's clean up all my weapons. Go 
go a little higher. Now nicely fill up. Okay, how are we doing with the actual weapons in a 5.56 millimeter pistol? silencer then the first time trying to buy the composite shot stock all right I meant to hit that too Oh, is the service rifle in here? Is that forged receiver? There we go. Anything else? Okay, so we got a survivalist rifle. That's gonna be my main. My shoddy is gonna be the riot. And uh, yeah, we'll just uh, hunting rifle. Hunting rifle's been doing its, it's been doing work. So let's do that. Go riot shotgun. Sometimes I think those guys knock down stuff. Uh... All. Get the leather backpack. Hell yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be great. Sometimes you just gotta giggle to yourself, laugh, cause it's like, oh wow, the amount of power you just gave me. Other thing, falling in Vegas gives you that power. Can't think of enough for it. Can't think of them enough for it. Can't help but laughing like laugh like an idiot. Just <laughs> All right, JHP. Of course, we need some more pistol powder because we can't just go with one bullet. And it's actually one of the reasons I bought so much 20 gauge. I thought you were still on fire for a second. that
Perfect. Now let's see how, uh... I don't think we're gonna be doing a great job, but I think we definitely lure a couple of those ghouls over. This should make any, this should take, or uh, do quick work on any ghouls, because I don't think ghouls have armor. So this should do double to triple damage. What did you just kill? I'm just gonna F5, F9, just so you guys don't have to deal with it. Giving me primers and stuff, such. Spider drone. I gotta admit, I feel a little bit better wearing all this armor, too. Okay, we gotta be careful not to get too close. You can come on over here. Can't run from me. Got him. I love this rifle. Even without the trip burst, like, I fire this thing incredibly fast. It's semi-automatic. I rip through those rounds. Sneak attack, sneak attack. Now for me, I don't go into this Legion safe house until I kill the Legion. Because you need a key to open it. So for me, I feel like you deserve to open it when you've killed Kaisar. Don't know why they never made it so you did.
Okay. Oh, he's gonna definitely see us. It's over. When I'm in third person, okay, that's a weird animation thing. Okay, cool. When I'm in first person, it shoots a trip shot. When I'm in third person, it does uh, semi-automatic. That is modded. So I guess at nighttime they go inside. I guess definitely modded in. That's the point, I don't know which mod it is. Is it the one that gives me the, uh, whatchamacallit, the additional GRA weapons all about the map? Or is it a world of less pain? Cannot access their door. Well, let's pop some rad X and let's see how it goes. Over there's a nuclear test site. Basically, this person named Trash wanted to become a ghoul. Instead, they just died of radiation poisoning. Oh well. Our bottle cap. So what, I have to catch him in the day unawares? Take a sip from your trusty Vault 13 canteen. Damn straight. Also a guaranteed spot to pick up some authority glasses. Which I think works with a good amount of outfits. We're gonna be fast traveling back and forth, fuck it up. Let's 
Boy, did they blast those guys. Good. Hmm. Well, I kind of want to fight them. Alas. Aww. Come on to kill them. Oh well. Wiped out N Nelson. Let's see if we can kill some death claws. You need something? I can take care of your death claw problem. I don't know what it is about you, but I think you could actually pull it off. Death claws are tough bastards, but you might be even tougher. Nobody here is any use to you in a fight against death claws, but take these medical supplies. You'll probably need them. To do the job right, you've got to get rid of the pack leaders, the mother death claw and the death claw alpha male. Should run the rest of them off. All right. Oh my god, we still haven't killed the powder gangers. <gasps> Walking in there with fucking military, like high grade military equipment. <laughs> Kill these dudes with fucking revolvers and shit. Yeah, let's start war. Alright, let's see how this is against Death Claws. If this could take out a Death Claw, we'll continue forward. Unsure. They got distracted. I don't know why you're there. Well, if I treat them like the death claws that they are, and I aim for the head, I should be good. What's in here? Cover? Okay, cool. should talk to us. 
If he's even up high. This is a dangerous place, human, especially for your kind. I suggest you turn back. There's nothing good waiting for you further on. What makes this a dangerous place? You must have heard a radio broadcast. The why a human would follow her invitation here is beyond me, unless you didn't listen very closely. The voice on the radio belongs to Tabitha, the supreme commander of Black Mountain, or as she calls it, the state of Utopatha. She took control of this place almost two years ago. The super mutants here do whatever she says, and she says humans are to be killed on sight. Sounds like you've had enough of Tabitha. What if you had some help? Help would improve the odds. Help might just make the difference. All right, if you're good enough at what you do to meet me in the village up near the peak, we can talk further. I'll have a plan by the time I see you, if I see you. Good luck. It's going to be a lot harder for you to get up there than it will be for me. Don't worry about your teeth, man. Don't have to move. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Head to the top of the mountain and end Tabitha's reign of terror. Optional. Meet Neil at the village. Well, boys, looks like we're killing. That must be Neil. Until daytime so I could actually see I should be I could survive the wait time I could drink an atomic cocktail if I need to sleep I've got plenty of food and plenty of drinks there we go oh gloomy How's that for how do you do? We're pretty much taking all the weapons. NCR Trooper. Oh, no, I see the shimmer. I see you, bitch. And we'll just repair that super sledge. 
can't. No, what the? F okay, no. All right, whatever. Apparently, I cannot merge those two. All right. No, I can still repair. That's good. What up? We're good. Another thing we're going to do is just a quick hop on over here. We're going to kill a fuck ton of centaurs, but there's also two corpses we need to loot. Ooh, that's an ugly one. Of ugly motherfuckers and mo. You're one ugly motherfucker. It's also where you get free power armor. Uh, Paladin Hughes of Fairbanks, I each you two to head to the nor uh, north to nearby communications array and look for the components mentioned in the briefing. The mutants there have been reasonable to pass to be proved helpful. That was before they were pretty much told by Tabitha to be dicks. Hello. Hello, my love. I'm sorry to interrupt. Do you like peanut butter? I do like peanut butter. Have some stream snacks. <laughs> Jeez. It's a stash. You can have them for a while. Oh, you don't? I don't like peanut butter. Oh, give me all your peanut butter, all the peanut butter dips from the... From, from the dip bar, yes. All right, thanks, my love. Love you. <laughs> You're the best. Love you. Love you, too. She is the best. Centaur blood. Ah, lovely. Now back to Black Mountain. Say we're gonna need another one if we're gonna get rid of that radiation.
We're gonna have to have a third. I'm surprised they haven't hit us with an LMG. behind that. In this sir oh well obviously still a service rifle but I'm really enjoying the survivalist rifle this 50 cal who knew that 12.7 millimeter would be so effective against soft targets oh I fucked his leg up well Let's see. Weapon handling. Now I'm gonna do weapon handling. Now I can equip bigger weapons and they won't be too bad. Got a machine head. It's better than the rest. Green to red. Machine head. Always goes in my fucking head whenever I see that. All right. Well, I'm addicted to vodka. They call Caesar's Legion the Battle Cattle. Nothing in there. Oh, hi. Oh! Oh, 
jeez! Why is there a death claw here? I got like donkey punched in the back of the head, damn. Don't walk around the fucking Nye. Jack that speech up. We do a lot of set. Let's do center of mass instead. Chances are I do it twice in a row. Fun. Fixer that's making me woozy. There's probably a death claw over here that because I shot this machine thing. Yeah, I don't care, I'm gonna kill it anyways. Right in the face. in the back. We're still being hunted. Minigun, high speed rotor. Say nothing. Oh, hey, Neil. Uh, let's see. Speech plus five. Oh my god, do I have it? Oh, the transceiver's not dead. It's because of the other side. I'm gonna tell her that I, I'm rebelling. <laughs> oh well.
There we go, fully healed. Four twenty bottle caps. Oh damn, that's tight. A pleasant surprise to see you made it. I'm ready to get started if you are. Let's do it. Here's the plan. The gate to Tabitha's compound is guarded by several Nightkin, all of them using devices that make them invisible. I'm going to draw them away from the gate by telling them I spotted an intruder in the village. Then you slip in. All right, I can make that work. Good luck. We're going to need it. Well, that didn't work out the way it was supposed to because... Well... They saw... Him! Oh, that was all the ammo. Oh, that's all my ammo. Apparently I cannot repair the minigun with a minigun. My intelligence might be messing with my skills because I am all sorts of messed up right now. All right, or at least I'm drunk. I've done what I can. The rest is up to you. Fine. See that guy? He has the unique missile launcher. Annabelle. Miss Launcher is the other game. Well, if I can miss find a missile launcher to repair this missile launcher, that'd be great. Prison building. Oh, it's how I unlock uh, Danny Trejo. Intact Garden Gnome. some of that down. Well, there's 
there's nine of them at least. Broken Mr. Handy. Requires key. Requires key. All right, let's go kill Tabitha then. Fuck, I wish I never shot it. Oh well. You could really mess with her broadcast, I think. Tab at this room key. Shoot music book. <laughs> oh, so good. I'm gonna go over here and use the key. Not as good. Varmint rifle. Well, at least the other room was good. And there's stuff hidden in here. I don't want to search around for all of it. Nothing to repair that with, eh? <laughs> HD cylinder for that police pistol. No, not the best loot, but hey, do you want it works? I actually do want to drop that. I didn't pick up any like 357 or anything like that. Big corner steak core off, so we'll just om nom nom that. Hey, we completed the quest. Good work, human. Maybe now this place can rest in peace. I still have a job to do here. Some mutants may have heard Tabitha's broadcast and are headed here even as we speak. I'll remain and direct anyone who show up toward Jacobstown, where they'll be much better off. There's nothing here for you, though it is always good to see you. Yay, I'm not hated. That's always a bonus. You can complete a quest and not be hated. Rads do be a bitch, though.
Oh, okay. What's fucking about up there? We should be able to descend well, though. Hopefully. Berserk blood blood. Blood bug. Okay. That travels to the NCR. How dare you move on me? Yeah, that's NCR. I just wanna see if I can no scope him. Really? Wow, that's actually wearing off that fast? That's a great place to kill robots. I want to see if they fired at him or not. Whoop. All the juice from Hoover flows right through the door. Stay out of the control room and enclosure, or there's going to be trouble. Got it? Prado. And we send it west to keep the home lights burning. Hmm. Ooh, that felt nice. Assassins. Yeah. Like, oh no, I forgot to reload. Make sure all of those uh, pellets hit, you know? Bowie knife. Okay, they're starting to upgrade. Got it.
Gotta like it when the game's like, oh shit, loading. <laughs> Yes, my health is low. I might want to eat something. You're right, game. Or, you know, take care of that. I accidentally took Psycho. Okay, we gotta go home. All right, and you know what? I'm pumped for how much we've got done today. Like, that was, all of Honest Tarts, a huge chunk. Like, well, we got all the raiders for the fiends done. Chunked out a few special areas. Got a couple of unique weapons. Like, damn, that's solid. I want to still stream that, so I might actually switch over to Project Zomboid. We'll see how it goes. I know I'm talking about streaming stuff in the middle of a YouTube recording that's going to be completely irrelevant years down the line, but who cares? COVID-19's still a thing. I guess that's like what the whole situation is, you know? These are world events that are etched in history and we're gonna have to deal with them at some point and it's gonna be weird when we talk about, you know, oh yeah, COVID-19, that was, that was 13 years ago, that was so weird. You know, oh yeah. Yeah, I remember 20 years ago when Russia did that stupid thing and invaded Ukraine, you know? I guess that's the one advantage of living this long, like, you know, into your 30s. Is you, it's not that you've seen it all before, because no, everything's... It's not you've seen it all before. But more of... You're experienced enough to know that, like... You're gonna... You, you, have, you have 10 years to look back on. That's not looking back on you being 10 years old, you know what I mean? When you're 20 and you look back 10 years on your... You're looking back on 20, looking back on 10. That's different. When you're... Because you're looking back on being a kid. When you're 30... Thinking about back when you're 20, that's you judging yourself as an adult as an adult. I actually be pretty hard for some people. Like in terms of they can't do it because like, you know, it's either A, too much of an abstract thought or B, they don't want to be that honest with themselves. All right. You know what, and I'm probably gonna continue, but Obviously on this game. Thank you for you who are on our YouTube. Thank you for joining us. I'm going to, like I said, switch over to another game pretty soon. But in YouTubeverse, I guess that means you have to wait until the next video comes out. Whatever it may be. Okay? So on YouTube, you hit that subscribe button down below. I love you all. I love your faces. You know how it goes. But on Twitch, we're going to keep going. That's how it is. Recording and not. All right. Peace.